Small Town, USA. And today we're going to take a look at Macon, Georgia, the heart and soul of the South. Macon, Georgia is a city with a rich history, a vibrant culture, and a promising future. Nestled in central Georgia, Macon has profoundly impacted the American South's development. From frontier trading posts to booming cotton hub to reinvented cultural center, Macon's history parallels the South's story. If you find this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and get involved. Macon emerged after the Creek Indians forced removal in the early 1800s. Its location at the Okmulgee River fall line spurred growth as a market town. In 1826, the new settlement was incorporated as Macon after statesman Nathaniel Macon. Macon boomed with the arrival of railroads in the 1830s and 40s as a nexus linking southern cotton plantations to eastern ports and factories. Macon became a wealthy banking and commercial center nicknamed the Heart of Georgia. Prominent antebellum landmarks like Hay House Mansion and Wesleyan College were built. By 1860, Macon was Georgia's second largest city with over 8,000 residents. Its railroads and inland port fueled the regional cotton trade and economy, lined planters' pockets, and necessitated slavery. The legacy shaped Macon's early prominence, but also the post-war struggle of the Old South. After Reconstruction, Macon slowly rebuilt its economy around textiles, manufacturing, and agriculture, but it declined through the mid-20th century, as jobs vanished and development shifted to Atlanta. Starting in the 1990s, Macon pursued urban revitalization. New economic anchors, preservation efforts, and cultural initiatives sparked renewed vibrancy. The city nurtured its heritage as birthplace of southern rock and soul music greats like Little Richard, Otis Redding, and the Allman Brothers Band. Today, Macon has reinvented itself as a regional hub of education, medicine, manufacturing, and arts. Colleges like Mercer and Wesleyan provide stability. Public-private collaboration like Newtown Macon catalyzed downtown redevelopment. Festivals celebrate local music and culture. Historic homes and neighborhoods are being restored. Macon's current success story spotlights its perseverance and offers lessons for other cities working to transform themselves. Macon gave birth to musicians who defined Southern musical tradition, earning the nickname Song and Soul of the South. Little Richard penned generate birthing early rock and roll hits here in the 1950s. Soul pioneer Otis Redding gained fame on the Chilton Circuit of Black Clubs throughout the region, centered in Macon. The Allman Brothers Band came together in the late 1960s, pioneering Southern rock by fusing blues, jazz, country, and rock. Capricorn Records shepherd Southern rock bands like the Marshall Tucker Band. This musical heritage created by Macon natives energized modern genres and U.S. popular music. Macon honors those contributions through museums, memorials, and music festivals. For any music fan or history buff, Macon delivers quintessential Southern culture. Landmarks like Little Richard's House or the Otis Redding Memorial Bridge trace the city's role in music history. And Abella Mansions transport visitors to the Gone with the Wind era. Buckmulgee Mounds preserve centuries-old indigenous earthworks. Downtown buzzes with restored historic buildings, housing hip eateries, bars, and music venues. 
annual festivals like the Cherry Blossom Celebration, Brag Jam Concert, and Capricorn Revival showcase Macon's culture. Contemporary artists, microbreweries, and art spaces further the city's revival. Macon's story of prosperity, struggle, and revival mirrors the South itself. Nowhere else so compellingly represents Georgia's heritage and promise. By honoring its past while building a vibrant future, Macon remains the heart and soul of the South. Stay safe, stay secure. I hope to see you for the next episode in this series where we learn more about the history of another small town or village. If you're curious, next we'll start our exploration of a small town in Connecticut.